A world where everyone has a decent place to live. That is the vision of Habitat for Humanity, a nonprofit organization that helps families build and improve places to call home. We believe affordable housing plays a critical role in strong and stable communities. We build houses for and with carefully selected low-income families who pay a down payment and no interest monthly mortgage. Those mortgage payments cycle back to help build more homes. Our partner families invest hundreds of hours of their own labor in building their own and often other people's homes, in addition to thousands of local volunteer hours and local business donations. On average, it currently costs about $140,000 to build a Habitat for Humanity home. And that doesn't even include the costs of land and development before the first nail is driven. Land, utilities, and more are all completed ahead of time and all included when calculating the total sales price of Habitat's homes. But none of this would even be possible without the donation of many volunteer hours, sponsorship monies, and your commitment to helping families achieve their dream of home ownership. On behalf of the families that you have helped, we thank you. Christopher Hall. I've worked with this organization for about 10 years now. What we do here at Habitat is we select qualified families based on terms provided to us by Habitat International. What a lot of people don't realize is that we are a builder, a lender, and we also have a retail operation right here in Blue Ridge, Georgia, the ReStore. That funds a lot of our operational expenses. How we qualify families is based on three things. We have to have a need, a willingness to partner, and the ability to pay an affordable mortgage. These homes aren't free. What we do is we partner with our community and together from ground up to the finish to the time we get the closing, it is a year long opportunity. A lot of folks don't realize that either. I wanna to talk to you today about what being a Habitat volunteer can do for you and what it's done in my life. I'm on the board of directors for Habitat for Humanity I started working in, with Habitat in 1998 down in Marietta, Georgia. I was uh, working with my church building houses and then I uh, worked as a faculty sponsor at a high school, Pope High School down there. We raised the money and built 12 houses in 12 years. A lot of the kids that worked on the houses were so incredibly touched by being able to do something like this. Felt like we were making a difference for them and for those kids, we were in an affluent area of the county. It was a really important lesson for them to learn and they were all very, very touched by it. Then when I moved up here in 2016, I became a part of the board of directors here and uh, started building houses again. It's a joy in my life. I love being able to benefit people to have homes and I want anybody that needs a home to have a home. Right. Habitat's vision is a world where everyone has a decent place to live. And without safe, decent housing, you can't really think of anything else in your life that would be more impacted for your children than to have to bounce around from place to place. So with that, I thank you myself. My name is Laura Thornton. Grew up as a military brat. Um, so just moved around a lot and went to college in Atlanta and stayed there, made that my home. Nine years ago, he was born um, early, NICU baby, a lot, a lot of issues, cranial surgeries, big long list of diagnoses, but uh, because of his health and his circumstances, I had to resign from my career. Put us in a situation, one, one income household, and then fast forward, I found myself in a very toxic marriage and um, the opportunity to leave came. And so I took my son, uh, his name is Joshua. He's got multiple disabilities and he's just this beautiful, bright child, little warrior. Joshua being that he's in a wheelchair needed um, different accommodations. I couldn't just buy any house on the market, not to mention the market boom because of COVID. Some good friends sent me the application for Habitat. And so I submitted it, stepping out on faith. and. <laughs> They chose me and Joshua to build this house. It's an amazing blessing because there's gonna be a ramp for him. I don't have to worry about that. We're having a roll in shower. Um, so he'll be able to go into his bath chair and just roll into the shower, no longer struggling to 
get him to bath. He's a growing boy and he's eight years old, 60 pounds, and I, I, I call it Joshua's home. Like this is Joshua's home. I'm just gonna be the one cleaning it and paying for it, really. It's built for him and that's the most exciting thing is because uh, just a few years ago, the situation that we were in, it didn't seem like anything like this was possible. I think a big misconception about the Habitat homes is that they're just pretty much like, here, here's a house. There's a lot of hours that you have to put in to work. You know, we helped put up the walls and the ceiling here of the porch and building a shower and painting and um, a lot of that is fun. A lot of it's not fun. I know how to use saws now and I got a tool shed, so, you know, goals. The other thing is the house is given to you, like, no, you have to pay for it. I think it's amazing though that they make it so that you're, it's affordable for you to do so. This wouldn't have been possible without the partnership with Habitat. All of the wonderful donors and volunteers and everyone that's part of that. This is gonna be our forever home and because of Habitat, it's making this dream come true for me and my son. Hello, my name is Kristen Haley and I am the owner of this beautiful Habitat for Humanity house behind me. A little about me, um, I am a former Marine. I'm a single mom of three kids. When I found myself to be a single mom, I had to move into a not so great three bedroom apartment uh, that was falling apart. And I was working as a server on the weekends. The owner of the restaurant I was working at told me about the Habitat for Humanity program. And at the same time, I decided to pursue, pursue my dream of becoming a nurse. So literally within days of each other, I applied for nursing school and for the Habitat house. And I started my prerequisites for the nursing program while I was waiting to build the house with Habitat. By God's grace, it worked out to when I had one semester off, waiting to see if I got into nursing school, we built my house. Now I have an affordable mortgage and a beautiful house for myself and my three kids, and I am a registered nurse. So I'm so thankful for Habitat for Humanity. I met some wonderful, selfless, giving people and the community is better because of Habitat for Humanity. Thank you. Thank you for supporting Habitat for Humanity. Your help for these families is beyond measure. Thank you for making affordable housing a matter of conscience. And with your pledge to build more than just homes, you are building strength, stability, and self-reliance with families in Fannin and Gilmer counties. To volunteer, donate, or sponsor, you can find us at habitatfgc.org.